Indeed, the African Seed Company is on a blitz to make sure that you understand some of the farming practices that are being employed across Africa. So today, we are quite excited to be in Malawi, where we are in our district, Vela, EPA, where we are going to be hearing from James, who is a seasoned agronomist here in Malawi, and is going to also talk to the farmer who is having this beautiful green mealy crop that we are seeing here about the agronomic practices that have been employed and the varieties that have been employed here. Over to you, James. Thanks so much, Wendy. Uh, of course, this is uh, uh, Lower District, mm -hmm. Vera EPA, uh, in Sangu uh, Village, mm -hmm. where uh, there is uh, this demonstration plot that was planted, uh, I think, some time back. Mm -hmm. Uh, there are a number of varieties that was plant that were planted here. Mm -hmm. uh, one of which is uh, SC Triple Five, mm -hmm. uh, one of the best varieties so far in the market. I think the reason why farmers are flocking for this variety is the issue of the crop size, mm -hmm. big. The kernel size are big as well. Mm -hmm. The raw numbers are more. I uh, think they go beyond uh, 14, uh, 16, 18 raw number. In terms of yield, it's one of the varieties that is giving out uh, the best yield and very suitable uh, for irrigation. And the, what you see here, this is the irrigated site. Uh, the farmer himself uh, planted this variety and he probably has got something to say about this variety. Mwina tingumva so kwa iniagi ya munda. Kote kodi chima angajimene jikuni tifiki hapa. Kwa jikuni ni chima angajosu sama liga wambiri. Choti nga kare antukunja kwa mwina kuza uchita nadu chidi wambiri kodi chima angaji. Kodi jifiki hapa. Anaji samari ya muda. Ndukuzo odi panapita kundi tu ndono meguzingapo. Zoti kindo chima angaji samari dwe. Kuchoke la kumazari dwe. Katidega federeza. Katidega mangwala. Kuti la kumene kwa mazi. Kodi kodi cha jitika ni jana hapa kwa nipwene. Tifuse anza tucho yambi ya di kutuzwele. Chabwino. Ineo ndi netobula ni kadi ha. Amene ndi makala mtu mwasa ngu. Fumu ya ikulu chiwewe. Nde kutikudon kudowa mzera EPA mwonga ni nagari. Ehe, ineo namba kutala chima angajasi. Wabwana. Na jala papuloti liyose, kambeo kake karikose. Mwonga ngari mungu wane na abamu. Nde kutipo faifi na mungu jala hapa. Nde kuti inaso mbiti na jala hapo. Ehe, na jala inga. Ehe, 789 ya. Okay, thanks so much, dear farmers. Uh, you must explain about the good management practice of uh, the crops that he has used uh, in this uh, field. I think number one, he has talked about the run preparation. Uh, he did uh, properly uh, his uh, field, uh, he, he plowed it, uh, he tilled it properly, uh, uh, broken all the clothes. I uh, did the the, the stations uh, properly by uh, doing the sunken sunken base so that at least uh, that water could be captured in uh, in those uh, uh, stations uh, planting stations and number two planting light seed uh, I planted a number of varieties here uh, starting from the triple five three zero one which is ultra early maturing varieties uh, the five, uh, seven two nine this is the new injovu. Uh, in the market. Uh, the other one is 653. This is in Congo, the best variety so far in terms of performance. And he also talked about uh, uh, how he managed the 4 MOM by uh, getting the right chemical. And of course, uh, on the part of fertilizer, he applied a fetch fertilizer, that's the NPK at day number seven, uh, the, the time we planted from the date of planting. And then he came in again at uh, week number three, uh, applying uh, the top dressing fertilizer, that's urea. And he has also uh, explained the benefit of uh, uh, paying seed in, uh, in installment, that's prepayment. Mm -hmm. uh, he's saying that uh, he benefited quite a lot uh, by uh, paying seed in installment. Uh, taking, uh, talking, uh, because you know, you know this, this time around, getting money at once, a uh, huge amount at once, is, is not easy, especially him uh, in the village. So at least you could be able to pay slowly uh, 10,000 kwacha, 20,000 kwacha, 5,000 kwacha, whichever amount. Uh, that he could get at that particular moment, he could pay to seed go. And he, uh, the good thing about it, he has got the seed now in his house. Mm -hmm. So he's happy about the prepayment program. He's happy about the variety that he, uh, we have uh, from seed go. And his expectation is uh, now we are going into rain season. Mm -hmm. uh, what is he uh, going to plant in, the, in this field during the rain season? He's talking about the, the 729, which is uh, the new variety in the market. Uh, that's that's number one variety that that he paid for. 
uh, through prepayment. He has also talked about the triple five. He has also talked about the six uh, six five three. Not forgetting the Karulu, the food security uh, valad, because he knows this is actually maturing valad by February. That valad is mature. It's ready. So uh, you you have a portion somewhere uh, with Karulu. So we are encouraging most of the farmers across the country that whenever you are planting a field, make sure you consider to have Karulu. Mm. This one. Kalulu. Kalulu. SC301. Mm -hmm. we, have got, we have got also SC303. Mm -hmm. This is one of the ballads that we're encouraging farmers uh, to grow, at least to have a portion. Wherever, whatever variety you are, that you're planting uh, during the season, make sure that you have got Kalulu mm -hmm. so that you don't run into a situation whereby you don't have food in your home. At the same time, for Dimba, it's one of the variety that is atra area. Uh, in terms of yield, it's good as well. Look. Uh, all the crops are not yet tasseling, but this one is ready. Uh, it, it has tasseled already, which means that any time from now, he's going to have crops, uh, no, no, no hunger in the in, in the home. I think. Uh, thanks so much, Bwana. Kuti munatenga thau yano. Munajeza nafe. Mwari mixa swari mikuti kuli bidambe o bangono bangono kofuni gira. Mbe o zagesu di mbe o zasitko. So zima yamba nimbe o yoyenera. It start with the right seed. Uh, for bumper harvest. Thank wow. you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, James, and thank you so much to our farmer. A lot of rich insights.